Hello everyone and welcome back to Resident Evil 3. So this is part 4 and uh, before we start I've um, read a couple of comments about some tips on my inventory management. So I did a bit of that off screen so I've organized everything. Um, I've combined my A and B grenade, uh, sorry A and B gunpowder into grenade launcher uh, rounds. So we've got a healthy amount of those at the moment so we're running that instead of the shotgun um, got the assault rifle and I also went and combined um, all of the, the leftover herbs I had so I've got a whole bunch of the green and red a couple of greens and then I've got these green herbs so I'm gonna try and stay more on top of the inventory management and see how we go and then I also believe if we go back to the train cart with some of the parts that we need not all of them there is a cutscene that is missable so we're gonna go back there with two of the items I believe that we have um, and see what it's all about so that's the first item on the agenda for now is figuring that one out and then I also just have to sort of uh, find my bearings again and uh, figure out what I've got to do because I've been juggling a few other games at the moment that you've most likely been seeing coming through on the channel um, so at the moment it's been a little bit since I've just played Resident Evil 3 so we'll slowly just ease our way ease our way back into it but we'll make our way back to the train cart and then I'll figure out where we're going from there I'm pretty sure uh, it was like the the fuse is the thing that we that we needed um, as well so I need to figure out what that battery is for because uh, I'm not sure I'm not sure if the two the two coincide I did leave those herbs here didn't I yeah so let me just take them just so I don't forget them. Rest in peace to my two green her uh, two red herbs at the at the gas station that unfortunately did not make it. Cool. So I'll just keep that together. And like part of me actually wants to swap to using the herbs, but at the moment it's just kind of very nice for my inventory to be able to have the first aid kit. Um, the way that it is, you know, like the, that being able to have first aid, three of them in one slot is very good. I understand that that is an easy mode thing, um, but it makes my makes my life smooth. Um, getting it all getting it all through. So I'm gonna keep keep that as it is. I'm pretty sure I am going the right way. Yeah, this does go to the train station through to the past the no bikes area where there's a bike oh god oh it's this guy that was um that was bleeding out before i can i'll save you nice oh there's more Mate, get in the train! Don't blow yourself up. Oh, nice. Oh, <laughs> good. T take the legs off. Quick Mikhail, thinking, mate. Do you have some kind of death wish? <laughs> death wish? My people. They were wiped out by these monsters. I can't stop just because I'm wounded. But can't you see those monsters are also the victims of Umbrella? Are you accusing me of taking it out on them? You don't seem to understand something. We're not really involved with the company. There's Carlos no already said this. For any of us to take responsibility for this mess. I know that. And right now that's the only reason why I'm trying to cooperate with you. Get back into the train, mate. Uh, sorry. I feel so useless. Don't. You fought hard and have the wounds to prove it. But I'm still alive. My men aren't. Don't think about that now. Just rest. 
It's alright, buddy. You nailed it. I could not save my men. Yeah, because it says mixed oil, right? Oil additive alone does not seem to be enough. Yes, I knew that I was missing something to make it a mixed oil. Well, let's put the power cable in. Um, I am going to go ahead and assume that that was the cutscene that I could have missed um, if I had if I had all the items. Maybe. No way to really no way to really find out. Um, but we've put one item in there. I still need to figure out how to mix this machine oil into mixed oil. Um, and then we have to find a fuse. So I've got to figure something out with the battery as well. Um, so best thing to do, there's nothing to get here. I just wanted to double check because I didn't get a chance because it went straight to a cutscene. Um, I need to figure out how to get through to some of the some of the other areas on the map here. So we haven't been to the substation before. So I think we have to go through there to get to the substation. So I need to figure out how to get this door open. And then, oh, the wrench for the bolts on the fire hose. That's what I have to do. Um, and then I can put that fire out. Done. That'll hopefully uh, hopefully take us somewhere. So those are the things at the moment. I'm going to see if we can get to the substation first because it's closer. Um, I'll have a look at my inventory and see if there's anything that I can do. Um, if not, we will just go straight to the um, we'll just go straight to the the fire hose with the wrench and then put out that fire. So I think that's a, that's a good place to start. I'm excited to use the grenade launcher a bit more and see how we go. I'm not sure why this door in particular is so dark. Um, this way, and I can take those herbs back to the item room. Cool. Straight across. Yeah, I can't remember what was blocking that door last time. So I'll have to I'll have to see. All right. For now, we'll put the oil out, and I'll swap it with the wrench, so we can have that on us. Um, put that in there. Chuck the green herbs in there. Now, in terms of what I have, I can't remember when I got... Oh, no, I got the lockpick at the police station, so I definitely wasn't able to use that on that door before. Um, I'm just unsure what to take with me at the moment, just in case. But the wrench should be good to just have to take the fire hose with me. Um, let's leave it at that. I can always I can always double back here if I need, but I'll try and keep keep less stuff on me while we get it done. So to figure out how to get through to the substation, just here, then here, then here. I have a feeling now that we just have the wrench though that it should just be going straight for that fire hose and we can finally go through that area after all of this exploration. The good thing is, I'm pretty sure, regardless, we can still use this way to get out. So, we've got the set. Oh, these guys come back. Okay. That doesn't have much range. Oh my god, it's going up. Oh my god, I hate these. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> I'm forgetting how to quick turn! How do I quick turn again? This one, yeah. The the whole that levitating platform up there is um 
I'm not sure if that's actually meant to meant to be something. Okay, this goes upstairs. And then it's a it's a lift. There is a slot. Oh. The battery. That's what the battery is used for. Wonderful. All right, we have we have our answers, which is uh, which is great. So um, I'm actually going to go get the battery, then we can go through the substation, and then we can also finally go back and do the fire hose. So I, I know that there are, you know, depending on which places you go to first, as has been said, it can influence like the events and what actually happens, which I think is really cool. Um, obviously, I don't know the outcome or the events of either, so I'm just going to play it as it comes and just experience it as it comes through see how it goes okay battery is up this way wonderful I have a feeling that the substation um, will, uh, will give us the fuse the substation will be the fuse it's gotta be it's power related and then we can go through and then hopefully some sort of either, either like more oil or machine or item or something that allows us to mix oil to get the mixed oil. It's probably naive of me to assume that it's that easy. We'll just have to, we'll just have to wait and see. All right, they don't respawn every time, which is which is good. But yeah, the grenade launch is nice. I like that. In you go. Let me up. Reusing the same lift from Resident Evil 2. Okay, that takes me that takes me down. Awesome. All right, new area finally. We got some zombies in here. I can hear them. Checking dead bodies is something that I've realized is like really useful because it gives me items, but every time it always gives me handgun bullets. <laughs> I'm not going to fill up my inventory slots with handgun bullets. Oh, dude, I got like, I was just, like for a second, I was like, that's like the same sort of like almost the same sort of outfit that Jill would wear. Oh, hang on. What's happening? Oh, he's vomiting on me. What the hell? Um... Oh, I have to... Oh... Right, I forgot that you don't reload the grenade launcher, you just put all of the ammo in it. Um, that saves a whole other slot as well. I, f I forgot that the grenade launcher does that. Um, and now I have 60, so things I never have to worry about. Oh my god, there's actually a lot of them. Yeah, it's got the same clothes as, like, Jill. It's really... it's really interesting. I wish the I wish it had a bit more blast radius, but I guess that's because um, you actually want to um, mix different. I know you can have different grenade ammo types. Um, I think the only ones that I was able to make was just the normal ones because I was just having a look at the um, I was just having a look at the like a bit of a tutorial on how to mix everything together. I can't interact with this yet, but it looks like there's like a keypad on it or something. It won't let me touch it. That door is locked and this door is open. So let's go through to the substation. What's going on in here? One hundred and fifteen to one twenty five volts is how I can release it, okay. Set to auto mode, okay. Nothing here. There's a door there though. When operating the transformer, be sure to set the power transmitter to manual mode. The old system is prow prone to short circuiting. Um, yes. Um, can I go in here quickly? The rusty knob won't turn. 
Oh, so it looks like that whole thing is inaccessible. Maybe that can be opened with something else. I'll have to I'll have to check. Um, and how does this door operate? 15 to 25 volts. Okay, so there's two doors to get open. Okay, let's have a look. First switch. So it's currently at 50 volts. Blue takes it down, red takes it up, I assume. Okay, um, I, I actually forgot what this is, so it has to be 15 to 25. Alright, cool, so I actually know what to do. Okay, so... Bring it down, cool. Now let's see what's in this room. There's the fuse. Just oh, zombies. Just one moment because because this seems like Oh my god. There's so many of them. Oh, I have to do something here. Head to the emergency exit, increase electricity output. Amazing. <laughs> that was so cool. Um, that increases the output. Um, give me a moment, because I don't want to miss out on the fuse. Um, what I was going to do, because I wasn't expecting that moment, is I wanted to be like, well, this looks like the room that I have to go in to get the fuse, and I wanted to open the other door, just in case if I take the fuse, it doesn't allow me to open the door anymore. That's my, that was my thinking, but let's see if I can get this other door open. Hang on. 115, what is it, 115 to 125, I think I had to get it on. Oh yeah, hang on. I remember that it's like, they literally have the numbers where it's like times three, times four. Um, let's take it down. And take it down. Then take it up. Then take it up. Oh, I got it perfect. Nice. Awesome. So we can check this room as well. Cool, so we got to electrify all of the zombies and access both doors. Lovely. I knew that the I knew that the um, the rusted the emergency exit was rusted, so that wouldn't have done anything, would it? And then I would have had to like fight all the zombies without the short circuit, I assume. Um, okay, so we got a magnum in here. Cool. That's exciting. Um, so that looks like that was okay. So the magnum was a bonus. We've already got a magnum, so I just want to use. I'll just, we'll just use these six bullets that are in here. Exciting. Um, cause yeah, I, I don't expect this would have changed anything. Yeah, it's still broken. Cool. And now this is completely broken and I keep pressing the wrong button to keep looking at it. Alright, let's leave. So we got the fuse from the substation, which is great. Um, I'm gonna check this door from the other side then, just to see. Zombie barbecue over here. Alright, let me check this door. No, it just says it's locked from the other side. Maybe then, if you do actually pick the emergency exit, um, you will be able to just, I guess, push your way or bust through the door. Um, which would be, which would be interesting. Um, it's not letting me do... It's not letting me do anything with with this. Like, it will just not let me select it, but it's just standing out so much and I'm not sure if it's supposed to. <laughs> I 
or whether it's something I'll have to come back for later. Um, I, I've tried, can't do anything with it, so I'm just going to head back. Um, I think at this point what's probably best is pushing through and going to the fire hose, so I'm going to get the fire hose. And then we're going to finally put out that fire. That's what I that's what I would like to do. So we're finally going back down to this part of the city. We haven't been here in a little while. Ooh, someone is fighting here as well. No no no, you've got no head. The Magnum doing a straight headshot is absolutely incredible to me. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry if you're if you're cringing at me using a, a Magnum on just normal zombies, but that is immensely satisfying. I'm still waiting for that door to blow off the car. Who was shooting the who was shooting the guy? Are you in the safe room, sir? What the hell? Was that like the, um... That was that dude. I can't remember his, uh... Can't remember his name. Uh, one of the dudes that was on the, on the train that's not Carlos. That guy, yes. Um, let's put the fuse up here. I'm getting so bad at selecting items today. Um, I'm gonna chuck a quick save in here. Just in case, so I don't miss anything. May as well just save it on a new thing for now. Just because we've done some stuff and I'm, I'm wondering if there's anything that I'm going to miss. I'm just being cautious. May as well just use the, the item slot if I have it. I mean the save slot. Um, cool. Let's go get the fire hose. I'm going to take this just in case. Because we've got, we've got space for it. And leave everything else behind. Cool. Yeah, I wonder if that was that guy and he's just kind of moved. If, like, he's just sometimes appears in random areas because he's also, like, helping to fight back. But I have, uh, I have no idea. Oh, yeah, I've got the blue herbs that are still there as well. The crates in this, um, the crates in this car are still standing out to me. And this is, these are, this is something else that I, I don't know what we can do. So I'm going to ignore that for now as well. I just realized that um, I've been too quick to go this way for the fire hose because I have to actually go get the, the fire hose because um, that's on this part of the <laughs> of the city. Um, so I'm not only wasting uh, my time, but your time. Um, let me just quickly go back and go to the fire hose. Oh, we got blue herbs as well. I've got I've got space. I got time. Um, also, I want to point out that I went to go run this way originally. <laughs> to go get the fire hose and then I went oh no what am I doing the fire hose is up in the other section and I ran all the way back up north again um like up in downtown like I love that this is uptown but I have to go up because it's up on the map to downtown <laughs> and I realized I was just like running around in circles trying to remember where the fire hose is and it was right here <laughs> wait a minute it's fixed with bolts Okay, just had to stand one centimeter to the left, and now I've got the fire hose. Alright, we finally got the fire hose, so we no longer need the wrench. Let's discard it. Um, cool. Uh, we'll keep the blue herbs just for now, because we've still got some item slots. And let's go use the fire hose, finally. Um, I'm pretty sure we have to go this way, and then it's here. So let's do let's do that. We also get a, a safe house before we do that as well, so we can reassess the inventory. Oh god, they've got these guys here. Hello. Hello friends. 
Hello, friends. You're so you're so nice. I'd like to keep you as a pet. Just just so so lovely and kind. Very nice buggy buggy boys. Don't want anything to do with them. Oh, we've got dogs as well. Okay. Um, I, I don't want a part of this. Ooh. Ooh. Dodged out of the way of that dog. Where'd you go? There you go. Nice. Um, I can get used to this grenade launcher. Um, I'm gonna need to find some more... Some, for, uh, some more rounds though, so I can actually, um... Actually get used to it, because I don't want to accidentally use up all of the gunpowder <laughs> that we have, but... We're spoilt for choice with our with our weapons at least, so I don't have to worry too hard. Which is which is alright. Alright, let's get these blue herbs out of here. Don't need any blue herbs. Cool. And then just the fire hose, and I feel pretty good about that. So we'll just keep it at that. Let's get this fire hose out of our inventory as well. Finally. Oh god, I'm gonna I'm just This is what I have to adjust to with the lack of um faster tech speed is I press A to like skip through it, but instead it presses A to um make the text go faster and then I keep accidentally repeating <laughs> the text, which is annoying. Firefighter Jill to the rescue, dude. It's so funny that, like, this is one of the first sort of hurdles that we come across of, oh, we need a fire hose, and then it's, like, one of the last things <laughs> that we actually are able to, to do anything about. But we finally made it through the fire, and then hopefully this should be where we're able to... Um... Oh, yeah, it takes us through to the sales office. Right, we're finally at the sales office. Hopefully this will be where we're able to mix oil together. Alright, we get some more blue herbs, I guess. Oh, the zombie's in the window to the left. <laughs> I was like wondering where he was coming from, he's in there. What are you doing in there, sir? Can I get in there? I don't think I can. That's really interesting, they're just gonna show you- that's- I actually really like that. It's like, the zombies that you can't kill. Like, it's just like, walking around the window. I bet I can expect him to jump out of a window though, at some point, because it's what they love to do. Oh, we got another crank here. And one of the- no! He survived! Check that dodge out. What are you looking at? You're trying to look at the dead body, okay. Where's the other guy? Where are you? Jill, help me out here. Alright, there you are. We got another one of these. Another one of these. What is this? Hmm. I don't know what this is. Oh well. Into the sales into the sales office we go. And then hopefully it's got what we need. Oh. What just happened here, mate? You do? I had no choice. He was about to turn into a zombie. It would what? have been a threat, so I eliminated it. But he was still conscious, wasn't he? He was as good as dead. And it took fewer bullets to kill him now than it would have if he had transformed. Hmm, okay. Not now, I'm busy. Alright, mate. Don't know if I uh, don't know if I buy that, but sure. Please enter password and then press the return key. What's the password? What's the character limit, guys? Alright. Um... 
Um, let me leave. Get me out of here. I have to look around. Ooh, is this a recorder? Manager's report? Before you begin your new position, give you some advice. Um, some of the medicine in the storage room are unstable and their quality will deteriorate under changing temperatures or humidity. Personally check it every day. Computer checks around the clock. A machine is not perfect. Check all personnel coming through. The door in the storage room is always locked. You will need to have them hand in their documents. Remember that if you find anything suspicious, contact me. If you forget the password to lock the door, try and remember that it is a word that everyone is familiar with. Try and remember that it is a word that everyone is familiar with. Don't forget that once a new product is shipped, the password will be updated again. You can always enter the password from the terminal of the PC for administration. Will you use the remote control? Yes. Does that mean the password is Safsprin? They just use like the latest, the latest product as the um, password. Yes, they do. <laughs> cool. Deactivating lock. There's another remote in there as well. Or is this... Oh no, it's the same table, it's just a different angle. Cool. I thought it was like, might have been in another room. That's cool. Okay, so we're able to check this out. Let me in. Ooh, what's in here? Can I... High temperature steam pipes? Why do I feel like you're gonna blow up on me? Ooh, we got gunpowder in here. And it looks like the mixing agent for my... Uh... <laughs> oh, there's a few of each. Okay. Um, hmm. It's a gunpowder C, as you can see, but it's invisible. <laughs> um, these don't combine, so I can't combine those. I made a mistake bringing the lockpick. <laughs> And I'm holding this crank and I don't know what it's for. Um, I have two free slots. I'm gonna need to take this because it's what I need. The oil additive, cool. So I can mix that with the machine oil. Um, where is the storage room from here? It's like right there. I, I'll come back for these. Let's just hope I can come back. Oh, okay. Get ready. The building's gonna explode. And I won't be able to come back here. If I'm not able to come back here, I'm sorry. I missed the gunpowder. But we took some of it at least. Them coming through the blinds like that actually looked really cool. Uh, did we just lose that guy? Did he just die? Yes, I knew that it would work. I knew that I could do that. Yeah, get high pressure piped. Are they leaving me alone? Oh no, they're not. Cool. Oh, come on. You can't. You can't do this to me. Thank you. Um, amazing. Uh, I think we just lost this guy, he just got overwhelmed. And that's karma for killing an innocent man, who we didn't even confirm with our own eyes was a zombie or not. There more in here, yep. Oh, no! Kick your head like a soccer ball. Oh, 
I love that the blinds, even though they did get like completely, completely destroyed, they're still like intact on the wall. Oh, oh, it's Nikolai's PC. Too bad it's broken. Oh, dude got absolutely eaten. Business facts. NET, we need additional. Okay, we have we have a business fax, guys. Very very important stuff. Um, okay, so we, we can't take the computer with us. We might still be able to come back and get the gunpowder. We'll have to see. We'll have to see how we go um, when we leave. We'll just see if this place randomly blows up <laughs> as we leave. Jill just leaving explosions uh, all the way behind her. All right. Let's go back. Um, we'll do the we'll do the item box management. So I'll go and dump the blue herbs and the new grenade um, gunpowder. I'm, I'm pretty happy with just making grenade rounds, to be honest, because uh, shotgun ammo and handgun ammo is plentiful. Oh my god. Okay, Jesus Christ, buddy. What the hell? Um, I actually have to say that I got so carried away with everything else that was going on, I forgot about you. Oh my god, the rocket launcher. Oh, he's got... He can just shoot multiple. Oh my god. Dude, stop shooting them at me. Oh, his rocket launcher's gone. No, 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 put me down. Put me down. Oh no, please, please don't. Please don't, sir. Please don't, sir. No, no, sir, please. I asked nicely. I'm asking, I'm asking nicely. Oh my, stop picking me up. Thank you. Oh no, he's, I'm dead. I thought I could get him. I thought I could get him. Um, okay, now I know to expect a nemesis, um, and I don't get to go to the item box. That's uh, really annoying. Um, all right, let's try that again. Okay, so I've gotten all the items now. I've had to mix two of them to get them. Uh, got the crank, got the oil. I only have a grenade launcher um, on my way because I, you know, was just had to play catch up because I hadn't saved in a while. I figured out what those things on the wall are for. They're explosive because I shot one when I was right next to it by accident. I had to use a first aid kit. So that's on me. <laughs> um, now I have to... Ooh, I could actually... I can't go around here any other way, but I can actually <laughs> go down here and skip Nemesis appearing, at least for a little bit. But there's no safe room. Uh, there's no safe room down here until <laughs> there for me to change my inventory. All right, we're just going to have to deal with it. I want, like, he knocks off the fire thing and a bunch of water comes out, so it's just making me... It's just making me wonder if I can escape and run through the water or not. <laughs> The way that he does that doesn't make it seem like I can. Stars. Oh my god. Stars. I don't know if I want to do a straight fight. This this alleyway isn't really my style. Will he come after me is the question. Stars. Yes he does. He will come after me. And why did he hit me then? Oh my god, I'm just... Okay. Now let me see if I can run through the water. I have a feeling that I might not be able to. 
Oh my god, that's quick. Oh my god, I can. Thank god. I was like, for a second, I was like, dude, imagine if I just couldn't run through the water. Alright. Inventory management. Let's get a, hang a handle on this. Um... Um, I'm gonna use... I'm gonna keep, like, a gunpowder B on its own for now. I'm gonna use the reloading tool on this. I'm not sure what the crank is for. Um... But let's just quickly figure this out. Ooh. Gave me 22 instead of 20 this time. There we go. So I now have enough grenades to last me a lifetime, which I'm a huge fan of. Um, I'm going to... I wonder if the, I wonder if the Magnum will do anything for, um... For Nemesis, we can only, we can only wait and see. I'm going to quickly use a green herb to heal. And then I'm going to save <laughs> while I'm right here as well. Um, so I'll take advantage of that. So if I die, I'm right here now. <laughs> Instead of having to replay all of that whole area that I just messed up before. So now I feel um, now I feel a bit safer. So let's try the let's try the Magnum and see how we go with Nemesis. So then he can stop fighting us, running after us. Ooh, actually, has the safe room cancelled? Ooh, I think this. I think hiding in the safe room has actually cancelled it. Um, that's nice. I like that. Um, then let's. We've saved now, so let's go back to the train. We'll put the Magnum back because I was only using that for um, <laughs> for Nemesis. Um, there's also going to be another safe room on the way before we get to before we get to the train. So I don't have to equip everything right now, just in case I need some stuff. Um, so I might, I might stick another weapon on besides the, the grenade launcher for now. Maybe I should just take the Magnum after all of that. Um, just in case Nemesis is actually somewhere else, I actually want to give him a go with the Magnum and we'll see how, see how he, uh, see how he likes a bit of the, uh, the old bullet to the face and hopefully he can leave me alone. Um, all right, let's, let's just get out of here. Um, we've got, we've got the items we need. Uh, I can mix the, um, I can mix the oil additive to the machine oil. Um, when we get to the next, when we get to the next room, uh, the next item room. And then we can finally get this train running, I think. And then we should be able to get out of here. Hope, hope that'll be it. Only one way to find out. Oh my god, you're right there! What the hell? I was like, where is he? Like, that's the music. Jesus Christ. And now I'm going to have to run away from him. Uh, this way? Yep, he's running after me. <laughs> Oh my god, this this is awful. I hate being chased by Nemesis, it's so stressful. Stars. That's right, you have to deal with the birds now, Nemesis. Oh no, now I have to deal with the birds. Leave them, leave, leave me alone. They actually did damage to me just then. I'm holding my hip in pain. Um. Hmm. All right, we have a safe room opportunity, and then through here, through here, through here, and then we make it to the train with everything. Oh no, what is this? What is happening? <gasps> no! No! What? 
Oh my god, I knew it. I knew these... I knew it was going to be something. Climb up. If I jumped off, I would have been crushed by them. What the hell? God damn. So that was going to be a trap for me the whole time. Jesus. Yeah, I swear if I would have jumped jumped off, uh, they would have just crushed me and I would have died. I'm not falling down a hole. No, thank you. Um, God. This is just stressful. Everything's out to everything's out to kill me at the moment. <laughs> Ridiculous. Not a not a fan. Uh, let's combine you together. We have the mixed oil finally. Um, and then once we pass through that final safe room, oh, I don't think there's going to be any other items. We may as well just put everything on us right now. Let's put the fuse in as well. And then I don't know what this extra crank is for that we've picked up. That's uh, that's that is a mystery to me. Uh, we'll have to um, we'll just have to wait and see if uh, we need to use it on something. Um, but I'm so scattered by being like chased after everything. So let me just quickly heal again with this other green herb, just while we're at caution. And let's go as fast as we can back to the train because I think that's it. <laughs> Oh god. There it is. <laughs> that stupid door. <laughs> just one guy that's finally just like, ha ha. I do not accept. We're getting out of here as fast as we can and hopefully Nemesis can leave us the hell alone. But I sincerely doubt it. I don't think he's done yet. this way. It has uh, has calmed down a little bit. I'm not hearing any nemesis music now that we've gotten into this next area. We've gone into downtown instead of uptown. This is the final item box before the train. But we've got all that we need. So we're going to push on. Run across to the train. I feel very tense. Carrying such precious cargo. I wonder if uh, Nikolai is going to be at the train after what happened. Or whether he actually died. Like, all that was left was the PC. And the, the other body was missing. So, no idea. Gonna have to wait. Stars. No. No. Oh. Buddy. Oh, yes! Haha! -ha. We quickly sidestepped him. And he's just gonna continue running after me. Is he gonna come? Is he coming? Alright. Oh, he's just blocking us at every angle. So he's appearing, like, right at the end of where we need to keep going. Oh no, don't tell me I'm gonna fall through the ground again. Quick. Dude. This it, play, it feels like the whole place is just falling apart. Well, no, no, no. Jill, no, do not fall down. Are you joking me? Oh, you're kidding. I've got a full inventory. Why is the city falling apart, dude? Oh, no. Um, 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 it's not functioning due to lack of power. Uh, there's a worm in here. Ooh. An emergency power supply. Will you turn it on? Yes. Uh, eh, please. It's a switch for the elevator. What? Oh, is there another? Oh, there's two. Because there's two... Where's this other switch? Down this way? No, wait. Oh god! 
Um. Okay, let me think. Is there? Oh, there is. It's right there. All right. There is another. I was like, I'm just trying to make sense of all these hallways. There is one right here. Stop. Oh, I just, I dodged and shot. Come on, come on. Turn it on. Yep. Oh, come on, let's get out of here. Lower the ladder, lower the ladder. Get me out of here. Come on. Please. Oh my god. Dude! Underground worm. No thank you. Jesus Christ. Alright, now I'm here. Oh my god, and I almost died, and I'm almost out of first aid kits. I have one left, and then I'm going to have to start switching to my um, herb storage, which is, which is to be honest, fine, because I have quite a few of them right now. Um, okay, just a bit of an underground worm detour. It felt so unnecessary, but they were like, oh, quick, what's the, what's the last thing that we can do at this point? <laughs> we'll just quickly, um, quickly make, a, make them fight a worm underground boss. I wonder if I could have killed it. I feel like I probably could have when it was open, but I'm I'm not in the mood. <laughs> um, all right, the oil, it's in, and now it's just the fuse. Um, is Nikolai still here? Yep. Mikhail, no, sorry, this is Mikhail. Appears to be in pain and suffering. Nikolai's not here. Carlos isn't here. But I'm assuming once I put this in, maybe they'll be like, "What's up?" Fuse is in. It looks like we're ready to go. There we go. Here, take this. Ooh, flame yeah. rounds. Cool. Okay. Uh, Nikolai won't be joining us. I understand. I'll operate the cable car. Let's go. All right, Carlos. Nikolai didn't make it. Ooh, it's I have a feeling. Good. I have a feeling we might need the crank. It looks like it could slot into that thing. Maybe it's going to break and we need the crank. That's all that I can think of. That's all that I can think of for the crank. That it would go in that thing on the right. Mikhail! Why'd we leave him unsupervised? Who's in the, who's in the train with us? <laughs> Is Nemesis here? Please don't be Nemesis. Mikhail! It is Nemesis. Of course you're in the- of course you're in here. Because why wouldn't you be in here? He just dodged me. I'm going to die. How do I- how am I going to do this? Oh my god. This game does not give me a good opportunity to um, to break free of his um, stuff ever. Ooh, the flame rounds actually. You've given me the flame rounds. Oh, I've still got the Magnum Equip! <laughs> Put me down! This is awful. Him... Him putting you... The fact that he's able to um, pick you up and then throw you down and then pick you up again is so unfair to me. Oh, we got him, boys. We didn't... Did, no. Okay, this is ridiculous. Get out of the cable car now. Yes, please. I will, I will accept. I accept your sacrifice. Thank you for sacrificing yourself. You've uh, you've been a great friend. Jesus. Oh, the grenade! You lose. <laughs> oh my fucking god! You lose. Dude, what a way to go out. No, the brakes are out. Ah! 
jump out the window, use the emergency brake. Um, emergency brake. Did... Oh, the emergency brake was wrong? No? Well, it did something. Jesus Christ. Um, that was truly, that was truly something. Um, Nemesis sucks. Carlos, are you alive? Ooh. Clock tower. Alright. Um, let's try and not get attacked by birds. Hey guys, I'm just gonna- Nope, we got attacked by birds. Let me get inside quickly, please. It's locked. I'm gonna die by birds. All right, I've got enough of you. <laughs> Guess I've got enough grenade launcher bullets. Um, let me check the. Do we have a map of the area? Oh, there's something off to the side here. Okay. No, leave me alone, please. Alright, this is just a waste of my time. Yeah, this is a huge waste of my time. Alright, we'll just go in here. Please be a safe room, because that was intense. Um, okay, this was uh, very unexpected. Um, where are we? A clock is etched under the keyhole. Ooh. This is, uh, this is not over. We've got a whole bunch of new stuff happening right now. Interesting. This is unexpected. I didn't see this. I didn't see this happening. Yes, but we made it to our item room. Wonderful. All right. I'm not sure what this crank is for, but we, we're holding on to it. So we've, we've got it. I guess that's, that's something. <laughs> Um, I have to move the first aid box out of here as well because we're now moving on to using herbs instead. So I'll keep two for now and I'm going to save the game and I'm going to end this episode here because that was intense so we managed to manage to do all that we can um, in those in those earlier uh, those earlier rooms, um, we've lost Nikolai, Mikhail sacrificed himself, Carlos nowhere to be seen, um, yeah, there's, and now we're in the chapel, so, Nemesis looks to have been broken off our trail, he took an incendiary grenade to the face, I don't know if that's going to kill him, probably not, knowing Nemesis, he's probably going to keep coming back, <laughs> um, but for now, we will end this episode here, guys. So thank you so much for watching this episode of Resident Evil 4. And I will see you in the next one. Thank you.